This is the shortest uh, address by the president I've seen for the 10 years I've been there. What do you take of what the president has said? He has mentioned the issue of uh, the CSs being able to sit before parliament and answering to questions from parliamentarians. Uh, I'm very happy that the president wants uh, the parliament to oversight uh, because I think the previous parliament you have a lot of gagging of parliament in terms of its, its, its oversight role. Peter na ule ulikuwa 2013 tulikuwa na uzembe mwingi sana kwa executive. Eh, CSS hakuwa naweza kuja kuongea na sisi. Eh, tukipata tukitaka maneno kutoka kwa eh, CS mara mingi tulikuwa tunapitia kwa machairman na walikuwa wanapeana sangina majibu ambayo haifai. Talking of accountability and you know summoning CSs by the houses personally after your nomination you are you're set to pass in through their hands. Are you confident you'll come out there at the same time? I don't know, I don't know. <laughs> Let me know that this will be that. <laughs> and uh, one thing that got me surprised that uh, is requesting us to amend the standing orders to allow cabinet ministers on the floor of the house to come and articulate uh, government issues. For me, on that issue, I believe that uh, we voted, Kenyans voted for a pure prestigious system, and it will be wrong to allow executive back in the house. Thank you very much, Moshmiu, and probably just to join uh, KJ right here, who might tend to disagree with what Moshmiu has said. Probably you've heard the entire speech. What do you make of it? The president has been consistent. Without letting you go, yes. probably uh, we can let the viewers get a, a peek into uh, the president who happens to be making his way out of this facility. There he goes, uh, saying hi to the parliamentarians. As you can see, the security are trying to I maximize. He's a man with a plan. He has told us that he's a man on a mission, and you can see. He's still the same president, uh, he's still the same hustler, chief hustler that we knew. Joining us right now is Kembu's women representative. Uh, welcome, being your first time in parliament, uh, having the first presidential address. First, how does it feel? Uh, before you go even ahead to tell us what you feel about what he's saying. Uh, first and foremost, I'm the Kirinyaga woman representative. I'm Jerry Maina. Um, it feels like um, it's a lot to take in, and we're just settling in. Just to get to hear from uh, Moshmua Aluke over here, no, no. Uh, yeah, the president has spoken. What do you make of his speech? Are there things? No, do you agree with everything? The president's speech was perfect. It was okay. He talked of uh, so many things about improving the economy of our country, and that is what we want. How do you feel about, especially on the president siding with the uh, restoration of CDF? Among the key issues the president has requested is that uh, things are made to make, uh, to make room for the Hustler Fund uh, to enable the SMEs. How do you take that? Uh, actually, the idea of the Hustlers Fund, uh, uh, the, the president should just implement the promises that he has made. If the promises uh, are viable to the Kenyan citizens, then there is no problem because our bosses are the Kenyan citizens. It's a matter of asking ourselves, do we want to retain very many uh, funds that we have? So change the Weso fund and make it... The president recently made his appointment of cabinet. He selected the nominees that are set to be brought before you, Babu Wino. How do you receive this cabinet? Are you, are you satisfied? <laughs> Will you endorse them? Do you have a problem with anyone on that cabinet? Uh, no comment. <laughs> No comment. Waziri, you have been given a nomination. Congratulations for that. Thank you very much. First and foremost, do you feel you are capacitated enough to handle that docket? Absolutely. The biggest capacity comes from what is the fire burning inside you. And for me, the fire burning inside me is to serve the people of this country. Uh, most people anticipated that probably the docket that you have been handed, uh, your colleague on the same side, Dende Nyoro, probably would have been uh, a competitor on the same, eyeing the same docket. Uh, what's your reaction on the same? We have got many leaders in many different dockets. And Dede Nyolo is a very important member of the National Assembly. And we are members of one team. And, 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 and uh, the president in his wisdom has assigned different roles to different people.